Hey everyone, how you doing today? I would like to show you how I sharpen my Ly Nielsen uh, scrub plane. It's a number 40 and a half. I'm out here in my tiny shop trying to record on a cell phone, but bear with me and uh, let me show you what we got. Alright, I'm actually hiding right here. It's the Ly Nielsen 40 and a half scrub plane. Can you read that in there? This is a beautiful little plane. That, uh, everybody who owns one knows they uh, they work great when they're sharp, but they're kind of a pain to sharpen. It's kind of a love and hate relationship with these things. But uh, I do have a little trick that works well for me, and I'd just like to share that with you. So let me get all set up, and I'll show you. All right, well, here we go. This is the uh, trying to keep you all in shot here. This is the plane. Let me uh, pull that iron out. The major issue with sharpening these is that bevel. It's not a 90 degree iron. Well, this is still pretty sharp, but I was just sharpening a bunch of end grain on uh, some ash. And, uh, I think I dulled it quite a bit, so I'll sharpen her up. What I use is this Lansky knife sharpening kit. Um, they work fantastic on knives. I did make a few knives here and there. And I've kind of adapted it to sharpen this plane. So let me set her up and I'll show you. Okay, here we go. We've got the iron uh, installed into the little vise that comes with the kit. Now typically, when you have a knife in here, the edge of the blade is way down here. And, you know, it shows you little graduations of the different angles on here. And you, you pick the appropriate one and you sharpen it in this manner but that is so long the iron I am in shot here that uh, I don't catch that uh, angle properly on the bevel there so all I've done is taken a little wedge put it on here just clamp it in place now, I, I preset that hole before I've used this plenty of times now, now the, the dangle of the angle is looking pretty good, if you can see that. So, now I will take a Sharpie, and uh, I just like to darken the whole edge there, just so I can see where I'm working, make sure I have the angle correct. You get the idea, you guys all do this. Let me install it in a machinist vise. I'm out of shot now. Let me adjust that just a little. There. Let me uh, reposition. I'll be right back. Okay, a little drop of oil. Don't need a lot. Slide that up through the hole. And just start working it in this manner. The beauty of this is I can follow that radius. I'm not limited to a 90 degree on the end. I could even change this radius if I wanted to. And, you know, depending on what you're working on. I, I haven't felt the need to yet. I think it works fine the way it is. But I'll just wipe that off a little. And as you can see, we're, we're working that uh, all that sharpie off of there now. So I know I've got the angle right. So we'll continue with the uh, coarse stone. Once we get it where we need it, I'm kind of going through this a little fast just for you guys. Then we'll move to the medium stone. And then of course, well, yeah. we'll, get a bevel, we'll get a little uh, edge on the bottom that we got to knock off. A little burr. I'm going to work on this for a few minutes, and I'll bring you back. Alright, I've been working my way down through the different stones, and she's starting to polish up nice now. And there's 
uh, definitely a little burr on the bottom. Simply, uh, I just simply turn that over and I work the burr from the bottom like that. Pretty simple. Back on top again. bore you with the entire thing. You guys know how to sharpen planes. This is just a great little tool to get uh, get that radius properly. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, she's sharp now. <laughs> it's inspecting the edge there. Yeah, she could use a little more polish, but you guys get the general idea. I'm going to pull you off the tripod and get you a closer look at it. There you go. You can see that it's a nice, even bevel, even plane, but on the bottom side, the bottom of the edge there, I still got a little bit more polishing to do. I'm trying to look through the screen and do this at the same time. Probably not smart. She's getting a nice edge already. That's pretty much it. See the uh, see the radius from that angle. It holds that radius nice. You get it right where you need it. All right, tell me what you guys think. Like I said, this is a Lansky knife sharpening kit that I've kind of adapted to sharpening my hand line. Works well. See it? There she is, all put back together. Working nice. Took a few shavings off already. Not going to do it one-handed and show you. And hold the phone in my hand, of course. Well, this is my first video for this channel. Let me flip this phone around and talk to you. Alright, as I was saying, this is my first video for this channel. I would love it if you subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, leave, leave me some comments. I'd love to hear from you. I always return comments. Or plan on it, I should say. Like I said, first video. New channel. Talk to you guys later. Thanks.